Okay, this is Nervous Nick. This is, uh, we got here the D Dell Latitude D630 laptop. And I'm going to show you, uh, uh, how to put a SSD in here. Uh, the number one thing you can do to speed up the computer, uh, the laptop, is to put, uh, upgrade your hard drive to an SSD. That's number one. It's going to give you a lot, a lot of speed. It's going to boot like crazy. Anyway, and you want to pick up, uh, I got an, I got a set of, uh, screwdrivers here at, uh, Harbor Freight. Harbor Freight. I can, I'll leave a link down in the descriptions there. Uh, you, uh, you want a good set of these. It's got all the different sizes. I got some old Craftsman over here. Uh... That's a one eighth straight edge, right there. We got another nice one right here, Craftsman. I don't know the size of this one. Uh, don't say. Anyway, uh, all right, let's get to it right here. Dell Latitude D six thirty. Even if you don't have the D six thirty. Your laptop's similar to this. Just gonna, you're just going to go in and take the panels off. And it's basically the same process. Just watch what I do here. Okay? You want to get your batteries out first. <clears throat> okay, you got... This is the primary battery. Just flipped it over. This is the front out here. Here's your buttons to open it. Okay. Okay, you got the... You got a latch here. We got one latch here. So you push them out away from each other. That one, that one just stuck there. For me, I think one of these broke. That one's stuck there. Okay, you want to you want to click it towards you, just about a quarter inch, not even not very much. You pull it towards you. After you push these out, push them out, and they'll stick. You pull it towards you, lift it up. Okay, that's the primary battery. We'll set, we'll set that aside. I also on this computer, where you have your CD-ROM, there's a you can put you can also switch it out and put a battery in there a secondary battery that's what i got in mind all right we got the we got, we got this is the cd-rom slot over here your dvd optical drive uh here's the button here i got the, the we're, we're flipped over here we're upside down though okay push the button in just pull it out slides right out just like your dvd rom mine's sticking a little bit there we go. We're upside down. Okay, take that one out. Just while we're playing around with the uh, hard drive here. Now I don't have a. Uh, I don't. It's in one of my other laptops. The, the SSD. It's the same size as. It's gonna be the same size as um, the one you got in here. But the one that's in there is gonna be a spin drive. It's gonna be from 2008. They 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 were little spin drives. They spun like a record player, and um, they were slower. So anyway, you get your screwdriver. And I already got the screws out here. It's right here. Okay, now here was, a, here was your main, here was your primary battery. Okay, it's right here. It's right underneath here. You don't worry about these here. These are just uh, pads for the bottom of the computer here, for the bottom of the laptop. Okay, you can have one screw here. I already got the screws out, though. One's right here. And one's right here. They're, they're, they're kind of at an angle here from each other. One's in the back over here. One here. And yeah, don't think anything goes there. I don't, I'm not sure. Maybe I had one over there. There's something down in there. But that don't hold the, uh, that don't hold the hard drive in. Just this one here. This one here. All right? So I already have them out. Let's see if I can get it like this. Get my screwdriver. Anyway, you're going to have a... I broke mine, though. I you, See on your outside here? Let me see. Let's turn this. Arr. See, you got a nice flush panel out here on the side of your laptop, right? And it's going to be... It's going to keep going across here, too. You won't be able to see that, that, that good. That, the way mine's opened up there. But I broke it off there. It's a little piece that goes on the end here. See there? And it's going to hold, it's going to be a piece of plastic across here. 
I don't know, they call that the caddy or something like that. I forget what they call it. But anyway, mine's broke. I'm going to show you. So I'm running a little ghetto over here. Anyway, I don't have this thing in here. This is the... Try and get this out of here. I'm going to push in one of the screw holes here. Okay, I'm going to push in this screw hole. Try and get it going. Right here, here it comes a little bit. Makes it a lot easier to get out of there with the uh, with the caddy on there. You got to put the kit. You're supposed to put the caddy back on the new drive too. Okay, here it comes. I'm just catching it there with the screwdriver. All right here's here's the original. This is the original. This is upside down now. Okay, I'm gonna flip it right side up. Here it is. This is the original drive from uh, going way back. I can't see the date on here. Somewhere it's got 2,000 something on there. 7,200 spin speed, one terabyte. It's actually a newer drive than back then. This is a pretty big. So anyway, in the, okay, this, this, this end thing here. This is the way we came out like this, like this. This end piece just goes, there's screws on the sides here. See these little screw holes right here? There's one right here. Right on the side of it. There's one over here on this side too. Right here, right at the last edge here. Okay? But this, this you're going to see on yours, you're going to have a... See how I clicked in there? I just slotted it in there. Ah, I dropped it. Anyway, it just hooks on the end here like this, see? And then it, it have a plastic piece. It, it'll all match up real nice when you push it back in. When you push your other drive back in. Take it off there. Take those two screws out of the end. Well, there's only one screw on one side. Take the screw out. Pull that plastic off there and put it on your new drive. Make sure your new drive, now watch here. You see how I got this, the little part over here? This is called your um, interface. This is a SATA interface. See how the little part's right here on the, on the right. So make sure your computer's flipped over. Here's the inboard of the computer, the middle of the computer, inboard. So make sure that the littlest one's to the right. And the bigger sides to the left on your new drive that you're gonna put in there. Okay? Little one inside. And then and then make sure and if you want to put the plastic back on here, out here, you know, it's gonna screw in on the edge there, remember? One side just clamps in and one side screws in. You just kind of clip it and bring it around and screw it. Okay? Then just bring it down here. This is your new SSD drive going in. It's gonna look a little different. Same size though. Same footprint, the size of the drive. You know, it's like a little thing of playing cards here. All right. So you just slide it in. Give it a push. Get it in there. And watch the screw holes here. Here and here. You'll see them start lining up. There it comes. It just lined up right there. Couldn't see it in the light there. This one just lined up right here. Okay. So don't push it in too far. I mean, you can go in as deep as you can, I guess. Strike zone. I can't remember what that one was. Something that Dell came up with. Don't worry about that. It's nothing. And then, uh, okay, hit your two screws. I sometimes I've been only running with one. Now I'm running with none. <laughs> I can't. I gotta find one to fit there. Okay, so you got your plastic cap back on the end here. Remember, you put that on before you went back in. And then you're just gonna put your batteries back in. Look at look at my look at my um. Uh, Go down and look at my playlist. I think I got. I think I got. Uh, I got a video better than this one. It's. It, I think it showed more detail what I did. Taking the drive in and out. And get a on the next one. I'm going to try and do one where we're going to. I'm going to show you guys how to get Windows 10. Download it free and load it. And so we're going to need it. We're going to need a. Uh, get a thumb drive. Pick up a thumb drive. And anyway, we go back to this. So now we got the the hard drives in. Make sure the button's out on my secondary battery. Make sure the lever's out. We're working upside down here. And go in here in the end where the DVD ROM went. Just kind of finesse it in there. It's kind of tight. Push it in and push the lever back in. You'll hear it pop and lock. It'll lock in there. 
All right, so that's that one. If you don't have that one, you don't worry about it. Okay, just come to your primary. You come to your primary. Just gonna lay your primary down in there. You got a little gap here. Oh, see, making sure it's towards you, towards your ear. Leave a little gap here. Get it down in there flush. And then we're just going to push it. We're just going to kick it that way. I can do it kind of hard. Uh, it snaps it in. It'll snap it in place. Okay, here we go. Watch this. I don't know if I even got it. Yeah, I got it. But one of mine, I don't think one of mine are sticking. Yeah, the one over here on this side. It's not grabbing. It's just getting too old. I might have to work on that a little bit. But it's it's holding for now. Okay, make sure. And then push the tabs back inward. There, This one popped right in. It's the only one holding it right now. All right. So that's, uh, check out my Patreon. Check down below my Patreon. This is Nervous Nick. I'm going to go ahead and cut it right here. Thanks for watching. Leave me comments. Oh, talk to me on Patreon. I'll answer all your questions over on Patreon. I'm down, it's down in my descriptions. I got, I'm starting a Patreon page. And I can answer all your questions over there. Leave comments. Hit that thumbs up. Hit the, hit the subscribe. Share my video with your friends. All right, see you in the next one.